So I think we're coming up on the end of the game. This should be the final video, unless I, you know, make huge mistakes, which, let's be honest, is always possible. So now that I've got some pruning shears, I can start pruning. Oh man, I, I don't know how I'm going to pick that lock. That seems difficult. And I'm making a broom. Why am I making a broom? Is there something I needed to sweep somewhere? Oh yeah, this totally needs to be swept. Look, look, it's a huge mess! Ew! Frankie's wallet? That's not mine. Wait a minute. I recognize this guy. It's one of Tony's guys. You know, Tony from the villa down the street. They are dangerous people. I don't know why you're after them, but be careful. If you need help taking care of that huge guard dog, ask Greta from the flower shop. She's pretty good with herbs and will be glad to help you. Oh, I'd be more than happy to help you take care of those monsters. The dog will not be a problem. Help me gather the material, and I'll make you a sleeping powder. Okay. I'll need poppy plant seed pods to extract the seed for the sleeping powder. I think it's these white things. Bring me some essential oils. They're in small bottles over there. Um, okay, where's, where's number three? Where's number three? Number three is here. Number four, I'll need I need mean. some valerian root. It's in a small heap. You'll recognize it. The ingredients need to be heated. Bring me the lighter. Where is the lighter? The lighter will not work without fuel. Before it's ready, I'll need to sift the powder with my sieve. Is that everything? Good. Now I need a sugary drink, some alcohol, and some ginger. Everything's on the shelves. Help yourself. What? No! Find something for me! Oh dear. Okay, well, at least this shouldn't be too difficult. And ginger, I don't know what that is. It's here. Good luck to you. Thank oh, you. and one more thing. Take a look at that chest over there and pick a nicer suit. You can't go among them dressed like that. You'll need to blend in. Okay. So this is how Frankie got his signature suit. It's a very nice suit. Kind of creepy music here. Kind of creepy music playing here. Because that's the suit the killer wore in the main game. I need to rest now a bit. If I open the gates now, the dog will attack me. I need to find something to distract the dog with. I need the sandwich. Sandwich, put the sleeping stuff inside, close the sandwich, and give it to the dog. There's 
Let's add musical notes. Need to find something there. Those are the bad guys. Those are the bad guys. Do you want to put all the pieces together to form a picture of a toolbox? So I'm guessing this is a tool shed. And this is another Hidden Objects Challenge. My favorite of all challenges. You can kind of see where all the yellow things, just like earlier, you can see half of the, half of the, um, the musical note things. Yeah, that makes sense now. Where's my smoking pipe? Lots of money in that pocket. This gives me this elastic band. Perfect. In order to distract the, the criminals, what we're doing is we're going over here. And we're using this as a slingshot. So we're going to slingshot this window because it's the farthest away. Oh, never mind. This window, which is the farthest away. Hey, did you hear that? That sounded like a distraction. Boys, let's go. Yeah, let's check out this thing clearly meant to distract us. So this is a plan for the heist, and I am looking for that musical note before I do anything else, so... Musical note is over here in the upper right, upper left. And yeah, that's why I'm saying we're close to the end of the game. Look, we've only got four more screens left. That, uh, those are the instructions for the heist. So they have the car, uh, and, uh, oh, what were the instructions? The car, then they lower themselves from the ceiling with rope to grab the diamond. Okay, and my brother is the one who is uh, driving the getaway car for these criminals, which does not seem like a good idea. What am I doing here? The game is saying I'm stepping back. And then I am painting a lion. Why? What am I doing? What am I doing with my life? I am painting lions. That's what I'm doing with my life. That gives me the chisel, which I can use over here. they give this to the dog, I have no idea. Oh my. This is how we deal with traitors. You two, the museum job goes forward exactly as we planned. And our fall guy, that bold and kid, make sure he doesn't make it out alive. We still cannot go back to our room. Um, oh, here we go. Let's just take this car. Okay, so. Item there, and, the, and then the next we're going to have an item in the lower left, it looks like. 
So now we're, uh, we're gonna have a puzzle to actually get inside, believe it or not. Well, yeah, that makes sense. We, we The museum is just not open, you know, to let complete strangers come in and rob it. So we're gonna get the three coins, and we're gonna use the three coins to make a phone call. And that gives us the key to the museum. Good tool. So instead of entering the museum through the main entrance, we're going to break in. But the door is open. I, I just don't understand. The door is open. Why do we need to break into the museum? It's not locked anymore. <laughs> okay, so here we're finding a bunch of different items. Um, like an apple and a football. And let's see. Bullets over here to find a loaded gun. Baltimore, who's your friend over there? We need a pipe, a lizard, and some rope. So there's rope, and a pipe, and the final thing is that lizard. Wow, I did really well on that hidden objects challenge. I'm surprised. Normally I do not. So yeah, we're just going to break into the museum instead of going in through the main entrance, which we went through all the trouble of unlocking. Hmm. So this is glue that needs to be melted. We might need that later. And did you know this is what you use to make an explosive before the invention of dynamite? Did you know this is a dark room? I can't see anything. Bruno, no! John, the ornament's been damaged. It's in a 19th century cabinet. Okay. Are we gonna light up something here? No, okay, we're gonna light up this area later and check through it. Trust me. Empty. Empty. There we go. Oh, but it's broken. Right. That was what the sign said. Okay, so we need to heat this glue in order to use it. What's going to get the glue off? This? Okay. Get the glue over there. We're going to take some of the glue off with this. Fix the medallion. Is this going to save Frankie? I hope this saves our buddy Frankie. Oh, wait, I'm Frankie. I hope it saves Bruno, who is... Oh, dear. Okay, Bruno... And the alarm is off. Bruno, you okay, buddy? Hold on, I'll get you in a moment. I'm just trying to find the the uh, the final final one there. I need to figure out how to wake him up. Do I have anything? What's this? Calcite. Citrine. No, that's not what I'm looking for. Sulfur. Okay, what about here? What can I steal from here? I'm just stealing things from everywhere. The old lamp. Let's let it on. Light it on fire, right? This is not a good situation. Oh, and this is dark. Um, I light it up with the lamp? Okay, that kind of lights up this area. What is this? It's a tape. Uh, oh, I just broke the tape thing. Oh, that's bad. That's bad. And this is one of those matching pairs puzzles. Best at matching pairs puzzles. Okay, so that's a knife. Okay, two knives. Two knives. You 
usually these puzzles, they just seem to me like it's just a matter of guesswork. Scissors. And scissors. Also, I'm not so good at remembering. That's, that's part of the problem with these puzzles for me. So, clock and clock. Final item is the ring. Water bucket. Right over here. Why are we grabbing a water bucket? What do we need that for? When am I going to look over here? This is a puzzle. You want to put the four masks in the right places. And that gives you some of the CH, the potassium nitrate. Oh yeah, water bucket. Wake up, Bruno! Frankie, what are you doing here? Saving your life. I came here for you. We're getting out of here. I was such a fool to trust those guys. But look, here are the building plans we used to get in. There might be an escape route in there. Why can't we just escape the same way the bad guys did? Oh right, because they, they took their rope with them. Looks like we've got a sewer right here. Hmm, if we could just break, break something. Oh, wait, 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 hold on a second. We are going to actually have to work a little bit harder to break things. And let me make sure there's nothing I can do here. Good. So we're actually going to mix all these ingredients together. We saw they make explosives, but I think we need one more. There are three ingredients, and I only see two here. So the police are sure taking a long time to enter the building. Fortunate for me. <laughs> whoa, whoa, open, open, open. Yay! Okay, now we've got our explosive substance. I'm gonna pour it inside this barrel. Well, apparently we've got a lot more than it looks like. Close this. We're going to put the film, the fuse tape. We're going to use that as a fuse, and we're going to explode the wall to escape. I guess technically we're exploding the floor. Fortunately, we've got a long, long fuse. left the car keys with me. Quick, take them and let's get out of here. Thank you, ventriloquist Bruno, who can talk without moving his lips. We're going! Now, we're going to New Orleans. We're going to get rich the way Papa always meant for us. That's the story of Frankie and how he went to New Orleans. Okay, so I've got a couple of things I want to do before checking out those ending credits. So, um, we've got some extras. Let's see, I found 43 of the 40, 44 notes. Is it possible for me to replay the bonus chapter and get that one missing note? No, it's not possible. Ah. Let's check this out. Um, I needed to find all the notes to unlock that. Concept art. Huh. Fancy. Yeah, 
That looks pretty good. Okay, anything else? How many pages? We got ten pages of concept art. Gee, I'm, I'm really sad that I wasn't able to unlock everything. Uh, it's just one thing away from unlocking everything. Redoing hidden objects puzzles. Oh dear. Oh no. Yeah, let's let's not do that. That sounds that sounds terrible. I already looked at the concept art. Instrument. I need to finish this puzzle. What? And these are the musics. Oh, it looks like you can download them to your computer. Okay. That's nice. And the collectibles. What are these collectibles? Oh, good. Is it letting me? Is it? Is it letting me find this one note I missed? Is it? Where is that one note? That would be so amazing. It, it's not here. It's. It's on the jazz poster. Okay, so that so that unlocks connections. During your adventure, I've encountered characters and discovered connections between them. Right. So what is this? Is this a puzzle? Huh. So I went through all the trouble of unlocking that, and it doesn't seem to do much. So I need to find the hidden box, hidden objects puzzle. Achievements, and I got some achievements. Looks like I missed extra stars. Collectibles in the uh, collectible hunt. And making lots of connections. So let me see, where's that bonus hidden objects puzzle that they were talking about? Because these are all ones I saw in the game. Yeah, I don't know what it's saying. Music box hidden object puzzle. I don't know what you're referring to, game. You need to be a bit more specific. So which one looks like a music box? I mean, do I have to solve all of these hidden objects challenges? Because there's no way I'm going to do that. So let's... What's the one I'm best at? This one looks like the one I was best at. So let's let's do this again. Let's see what it is the game wants me to do here. I was best at this because it was at the very start of the game. But it's looking like all this does is let you redo the hidden objects challenges that you, you did in the game. It's not looking like this actually unlocks anything. So that gives me a 92% accuracy. Give me a good score. So yeah, no, no, no. That doesn't look like that actually unlocks anything. That doesn't... I... Hmm. So those are all the bonus things that you get in the bonus version of the game. And I'm going to finish this video walkthrough by showing you the credits. So this has been Orgel Funf playing Cadenza. Music, Trail and Death. I hope you enjoyed the video walkthrough. I guess before I finish, I could talk a little bit more about this game. Um, it came out in May 2014. I played through the first chapter and said, Oh, this is great! I love it! I want to play the entire game! And unfortunately, the 
this video walkthrough has already become outdated. They made the sequel in April 2015, so the sequel came out 11 months after the original game. So I imagine all the cool kids were uh, play are playing the sequel, whereas I, I'm playing the original. That's something that happens to me an awful lot. Like, like uh, I get this game, and, you know, I really, really like it, and I'm going to do a walkthrough for it. I just, for whatever reason, did not find the time. And then they make the sequel before I finish the original walkthrough. So I don't find it incredibly helpful when they have uh, voice actors like this, when it doesn't say when, um, or it doesn't say who does what voice. As the game producers say thank you for playing the game and buying it and supporting their company, so I say thank you for watching my video walkthrough and supporting my YouTube channel. Goodbye, everybody.